At the busy corridors of Beirut International Airport, Officer Nasser and his four-legged partner Jim embarked on their routine patrol. Jim, a German shepherd with a finely tuned nose, usually went about his duties calmly. However, on this particular day, an ordinary routine would transform into a mysterious story. Welcome to Wonderbot Animals. Surrounded by the orchestrated chaos of travelers and cargo, Jim's ears perked up as they approached a seemingly unremarkable suitcase from Ukraine bound for Beirut. Despite its nondescript appearance, something about the suitcase captured Jim's attention. He hesitated, then sprinted towards it, leaving Officer Nasser perplexed. Jim's behavior was unusual. Instead of his usual vigorous barks, he emitted a low whimper and urgently crouched down in front of the suitcase. Officer Nasser, seasoned with years of experience, recognized the significance of this odd behavior. It hinted at something beyond their usual findings. The box, traveling from Ukraine to Beirut, bore nearly invisible holes that piqued Jim's curiosity. The shepherd recoiled each time he sniffed around them, as if hit by a foul stench undetectable to his handler. Concerned about potential dangers, Officer Nasser called in the bomb disposal team to inspect the suspicious package. Clad in protective gear, the bomb disposal team ushered the box into an isolated room away from onlookers. Tension mounted as the officers exchanged glances, their curiosity mixed with apprehension. Jim remained unusually animated, his tail wagging urgently, reflecting the gravity of the situation. As the bomb squad examined the box, speculations flew among the officers outside. Finally, a sigh of relief echoed through the room as the package was declared free of explosives. Yet, the mystery persisted. What had elicited such an unprecedented reaction from Jim? Tracing the tiny holes in the box, Officer Nasser noticed a faint smell emanating from them. Jim had indeed detected something odd. With a collective decision, the officers braced themselves to open the box, unsure of what they would find. But before we discover what they found, give this video a like to help us reach 10K likes and subscribe to the channel for more. As the lid creaked open, the officers were met with a sight that defied their expectations. Three Siberian tiger cubs, shocked by the sudden light, were huddled together within the sawdust-filled crate. An astonished silence settled upon the room. After opening the box, Officer Nasser found himself momentarily speechless. The revelation of the tiger cubs' presence unfolded a tale that surpassed their training and plunged them into an unfamiliar world of animal negligence. Carefully extracting the cubs, the reality of their plight became increasingly evident. The tiger cubs, born in a zoo in Ukraine and destined for Damascus, were supposed to be traded but ended up in a crate without proper care. Dehydrated and with messy fur, they bore the scars of their harrowing journey. Moved by compassion, the officers provided blankets and water to make a comfortable space for the tiger cubs in the airport. When animal control arrived, they took the tiger cubs to a safe place where they could receive proper care and attention. The tiger cubs, now named Maya, Tanya and Anton, became symbols of bravery. Despite their tough start, they were given a second chance at life by dedicated caretakers and veterinarians. The rehabilitation process involved physical and emotional healing, as well as social development. Gradually, Maya, Tanya and Anton began to adjust to their new environment, their personalities emerging as they explored their surroundings. This entire situation sparked a global conversation about animal trafficking and the importance of treating animals with care and kindness. As you may already know, animal trafficking has a profound negative impact on both individual animals and entire ecosystems. For one, animal trafficking often targets species that are endangered or threatened with extinction. By removing them from wild populations, traffickers contribute to the decline of these species, disrupting ecosystems and negatively affecting biodiversity. Animals subjected to trafficking often suffer a lot in the process, which is just inhumane. They're often captured with violent methods and when they're transported, 
They're cramped into limited spaces like it happened with these tiger cubs and they're kept in unsanitary conditions. Additionally, animals being trafficked don't receive any care and attention. In extreme cases, they're even abused and many of them die before they make it to their destination due to stress, injury or illness. Much of animal trafficking involves the illegal trade of protected species, contravening national and international laws aimed at conserving wildlife. Not only is it illegal, it can be dangerous to animal and human health. The capture, transport and trade of wild animals can facilitate the spread of zoonotic diseases, which are illnesses transmitted between animals and humans. Wildlife trafficking increases the likelihood of disease transmission, posing significant public health risks. Moreover, many species targeted by traffickers hold significant cultural and ecological value. They may play important roles in indigenous cultures, traditional practices and ecosystem functioning. As a result, the loss of these species can have profound cultural, spiritual and ecological consequences. Overall, animal trafficking represents a serious threat to global biodiversity and animal welfare, among other things. That day at the airport, Officer NASA and the world got a glimpse into that. But thanks to Jim, the tiger cubs were saved. This story also raised awareness, which is so important to make a change. As Maya, Tanya and Anton took their next steps towards a life closer to their wild heritage, they served as a reminder of the resilience of animals and the power of compassion in overcoming adversity. Their extraordinary story inspired countless individuals and reinforced the need for vigilance in protecting wildlife. What do you think of today's story? Let us know in the comments and leave kind words for Jim, who was such a good boy. Don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to the channel for more. See you next time.